Greetings fellow humans, Bad Mark with Mac Tech Keyboards with another transmission from Keyboard World and today I'm just doing a quick unboxing. Uh, today I got uh, two packages. Yeah, I got a really good deal on this during the sale on AliExpress and actually talked to the seller and was able, yeah, hey I'm buying two boards, give me a discount. I got a pretty good deal for two boards but today, uh, right now I'm just going to be talking about this one. This is the Fancy Alice. I've seen it around for a minute. Um, everybody seems to be getting into Alice, including Keychron. They just announced theirs, I believe it was today or yesterday. Um, they're Alice. So here's the PCB. Um, and this is a stacked acrylic. I am a big fan of stacked acrylic. I, I love the acoustic profile. I think they require very minimal mining and they sound amazing. So I'm expecting this one to be uh, good as well. So a lot of times they will either come already put together but loose or they'll come like this. They've just been cut. Uh, this stuff is protective layering that comes off. Um, the plate looks like we have... Huh. Feels like that's probably, I believe it's a palm plate. I forgot. I read so many specs on so many different keyboards. So, yeah. So, looks like we got some stabs just here and here. Um, here we've got the gaskets and we've got studs as well as a cute little moose screwdriver. And all the screws that we're going to need. It looks like there's some extras in there as well. We have the, um, should be a name for this. This is the dampening pad that goes between the plate and the PCB. So, I mean, I guess it's a plate dampening pad, but um, just the way I like to explain it, it creates little acoustic chambers where all the switches are. Now that kind of sucks, but well, I could probably fix that. Other than that, I mean, that is a defect, but hey. So, oh, and that's, yeah, all right, it goes like that. And then we have, all right, that, I don't know if that comes off or not. And we actually have, um, this is a manufacturer's version of a Tempest Hipmon. Uh, this basically is just a little bit of foam to set on the back. You see the cutout. Oh, no, wait a minute, this is actually, never mind. This is foam for the PCB, if I'm not mistaken. I thought it was actually foam for the, um, comes in a Ziploc bag, Ziploc static free bag. Don't see these too often. Alright, so here's the PCB. Ah, very interesting. We've got, uh, Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, no, these are the underglow. I'm looking from below, but that's what I wanted to see. These appear, this appears to go this way, though. Yeah. So, even this lines up with those dots, which are the USB. So, yeah, that this is basically my, um, my mistake. This is more like an EVA, um, you know, putting the, the EVA, the thin foam, the PE foam, I'm sorry, not EVA, PE foam on your um, plate. Now it's a little wrinkled, but I'm sure once we uh, start getting a few in there, it'll fit. That ha That's actually very nice. And as you can see, they're south facing and five pin compatible. And then here we got the rest of the pieces of the case. Uh, all right. So, Stack the acrylics. I mean, it, it, they do look. I remember. Well, it wasn't the first one because the first one I got was already built. But the first one I had to build, I was like, "Whoa, that's a lot of pieces." But then you realize it's actually quite easy. I will probably go take a look at a video uh, before I do a video on building it myself because I know a lot of people are interested about this one. Um, I know some people went for the Akko. I went for this one. 
primarily because this one is QMK by compatible and being on its user that's a huge thing for me yeah, I know I'm putting that pad in there with it as well um, this one's on top so basically going back the way it came in man I like the lines I gotta say I do like the lines of this um, this should be I mean this is my first Alice Arasu I mean, it's not an Arasu I know it's an Alice but this is my first um, besides I mean obviously a, a Microsoft ergonomics doesn't count but I mean it was kind of like a grand cousin of this I don't know but all right so that was just a quick unboxing I will uh, probably be doing a video of this in the near future just wanted to kind of show you guys what's in the box and what it entails. I'll come back later with a full video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Keep calm and keyboard on.